Jasmine is my babysitter by Apple Jordan, illustrated by Mario Cortez or Cortez and Marexo Andrew. It was an exciting day in the kingdom of Agrabah. The Sultan was expecting some very special guests. King Abbott is coming with his children for a visit, he told Jas Jasmine. The king is an old dear friend of mine. It will be wonderful to see him after all these years. So, okay, there we have the Sultan telling Jasmine the news. They, yeah. At last, the king arrived with his family. Ah, Abbott, how good to see you, the sultan greeted his friend. And what a treat it is, and what a treat it is to meet your lovely children. The king tried to introduce Rami, Lena and Hannah, and Hannah to the sultan, but they were too busy running excitedly through the palace. Why don't I look after the children? Jasmine offered. I'll show them around so you and my father can have a peaceful visit. The king agreed. You are very kind, he said. So there's Jasmine actually offering to look after the kids. And... Okay, there's Rami. I think that's Lena and Hana. The siblings follow Jasmine outside to the garden. I come here every morning, she said. It's my favourite spot in the whole garden. I love it too, said Hana, sniffing a rose bush. It's beautiful, said Rami and Lena. No, okay. But Rami and Lena were bored. Our garden at home is much bigger. Oh, sorry. Our garden at home is much bigger. Lena bragged. So, okay. There's Hana admiring the garden with Jasmine. And there are Rami and Lena looking bored. Jasmine took them to meet Raja. Hana gave the tiger a big hug. He's so soft and cuddly, she said. Raja wouldn't mind taking you for a ride, Jasmine said. But be gentle and only one at a time. We have elephants and camels at home that can give all three of us a ride at the same time. Rami boasted. <laughs> so, yeah. There's Jasmine introducing Raja to uh, the kids. And, yeah. Okay. This is how we all take a ride on the magic. Then how about we all take a ride on the magic carpet, Jasmine suggested. So they were soon they were flying high above the village of Agra Agrabah. Whee! yelled Hana. This is fun! But Rami and Lena were still bored. Our magic carpet at home is faster. They complained. Uh, some kids are just not easy to please, are they? So there's Hana hugging Raja. And there are Rami and Lena not looking impressed. And there's Jasmine on the carpet with the kids. Yeah, two moaners and one happy kid. This is tougher than I thought, Jasmine said to herself. 
the king's children are hard to please. Then she had an idea. Jasmine asked the genie for help. He agreed to grant each child one wish. Thank you, genie, said Jasmine. That should make them happy, at least. At least she hoped it would. The children were excited when they heard the news. A wish from a real genie. So there's the genie agreeing to help out, and there's the kids. Actually excited they're going to get a wish each. What are they going to wish for? Rami knew right away what he wanted. I wish for the biggest playground in the world, he said. All of a sudden, poof! The genie turned the palace garden into an endless maze of golden swings, slides and jungle gyms. It was the biggest playground the children had ever seen. Hooray! They yelled, running up the ladders and sliding down slides. Running up ladders and sliding down slides. Okay, I'm not sure it's a good idea to turn the palace garden into a path, but there you go. It's done. Yep. Okay, that's the right page. But when Hana climbed up the biggest slide, she got nervous. I can't get down, she called to Jasmine. It's too high. You can do it, Jasmine coaxed from below. Hana was too afraid to go. Jasmine climbed to the top of the slide. I'll go down with you, she said. Hana held on to Jasmine and the two slid down. Together. Thank you for helping me, she said to Jasmine when they landed at the bottom. Uh, right, okay, so there's Hana stuck at the top of the slide and Jasmine trying to coax her down. And the same picture from the front of the book, them sliding down together. Next, it was Lena's turn to make a wish. I wish for all the sweets in the world, she said. Ah, the classic never-ending sweet wish. That's a tough one, said the genie, uh, the genie said with a wink. But I think I can do it. He got to work. Alakazam, alakazoo, poof! A giant machine mechanic magically appeared. Each time a button was pushed, a new sweet popped out. Ah, greedy little so-and-so. Yep, of course, one kid would wish for something like that. <laughs> okay. The children ate so many sweets, they soon had tummy aches. My tummy hurts, said Hannah. As Jasmine comforted little Hana, she asked the genie if she could have a wish too. The genie agreed. I wish for no more sweets, Jasmine said. Good idea, said the genie. He waved his arms and poof, the sweet contraption disappeared. When the children felt better, it was finally Hana's turn. I wish, she began. Everyone was eager to hear her wish. What amazing thing would she ask for? How big would it be? I wish I was just like Jasmine, she said. Uh, are you sure, Hana? So yeah, there you go. Tommy ache. Jasmine's wish and Hana's wish. <laughs> Okay. I'm sorry, the genie said, but I can't grant that wish. 
Why not? Anna asked, disappointed. Because you already like the princess, said the genie. Anna was confused. You are kind and caring, the genie explained, just like Jasmine. Jasmine hugged Anna. And that means you get to make another wish. Yeah, and that means, the genie told her. Anna thought and thought. Okay, so there's the genie obviously denying Hana's first wish because she's already like Jasmine. And there they are hugging and... So what's her wish going to be then? I got it, she said at last. I wish for the biggest party in the world. Okay. And there's the party going ahead. Because we know what is going to happen now. For Jasmine. The best babysitter in the world. And there they are hugging like a family. And that was Jasmine is my babysitter. Although <clears throat> there are three kids being looked after in the story. So that should have been Jasmine is our babysitter. Anyway. That's it for the current flow of books. So we'll be taking a break until I get more, and then the season will continue. So until then, good night.